Hello and welcome to this video tutorial. Today we're looking at a number of ways that you can rotate text in Microsoft Word. Now one of the simplest ways of rotating text is to actually place your text inside a text box. So you'll go to the insert tab here and go to text box and click down here in the draw text box area. And you're just going to drag out a text box in your document and then type your type into this. From here, you can go to the Home tab on the ribbon and select the parameters for your text. So you can, for example, make it colored or you can use a special style for it. So let's choose this style here. Now, as a text box, this can be rotated and when it's rotated, the text inside it can be rotated as well. Just be aware that whenever you click on it and go back to trying to rotate it, it is going to jump into its original position and you will have to be careful and aware of that. Now, if you don't want it to have this border around it, then you'll just go to the shape format tab that's going to show when you have the shape selected and you're going to shape outline and choose no outline. And now the text won't have an outline on it, but you will be able to rotate it as you like. Another way to add text that can be rotated onto a page is to put it inside a shape. Go back to your insert tab, this time select shapes. There are lots of shapes that you can use, lots of interesting ones. I'm just going to choose a very simple rounded rectangle. Right click and choose add text. You can now select your text as before. Go to the Home tab on the ribbon and set the parameters for the text so you can choose its color and font, etc. When you go to rotate the shape, then the text is going to rotate with the shape. If you don't like the way the shape looks, just select on it and go to the Shape Format tab. And you can do things such as change its color and style. There are lots and lots of options that you can use here, including just having nothing at all. So I'm going to choose a colored outline here because that's going to make it very easy for me to just set this to no outline. And here we have our text that is rotatable, but it doesn't look like it's in a shape because you can't see the outline of the shape. One somewhat old fashioned, if you like, method of adding text that will rotate is to use Word Art. I'll go to insert and come across here to Word Art and I can click to add a Word Art object. Now you can make these just plain objects or you can go with the look of the text that you're getting here. Now a Word Art object is just very simple to use. You're just going to select over the text that's already there and then replace it with your text. There are lots of options for Word Art in terms of formatting. You can see here that it is basically just a shape. So if it has edges or anything specific around it that you don't like, you can remove those. But you can also add things. So you can add elements such as color and backgrounds and shadows to your Word Art if you want to. But of course, we came here to rotate text. And so the Word Art object will allow you to rotate it. Now it is showing a bit of weird behavior and that's just because I'm rotating it. So you may need to rotate it, get it into position and then move it to wherever it is that you want it to be. One final method of creating text that you can rotate is to make it a picture. So you're just going to type your text into your document, then select over your text and format it the way you want it to look. Still on the Home tab and still with your text selected, you're going to click on Copy. And then with the text still selected so we can replace it, we'll go to the Paste option. So just click this down pointing arrow, choose Paste Special, and then choose Picture Enhanced Metafile and click OK. And now this is a picture. It does have a couple of small problems that we're going to need to deal with. You can see it's much bigger than it was in the document. Well, we're going to select it, go to picture format. We'll go to the crop options. You want to click the down pointing arrow so you can actually use crop. And then you're going to crop closely in around your text because you don't want to bring a whole lot of extra content in as your picture. So I'm just going to make that a bit smaller. When I'm ready, I'm just going to click on the crop tool again because that will crop that content away. 
If you want the content to be permanently deleted, whatever you just cropped away to be permanently deleted, go up to Compress Pictures, choose Apply Only to this picture and delete cropped areas of pictures. You can just use the default resolution or increase it if you want to. I'm just going to use the default. Now the excess picture has been cropped away, but you can see I'm not able to move my picture. A little bit frustrating. The reason is that this is in line with text. So we'll come to this little Layout Options fly out, click on it and choose some other option such as square. Now that it's square, it is movable and it's rotatable. So there are four handy options for creating text that can be rotated in Microsoft Word. Three of these are going to be editable and the last one, the picture one, of course, is not editable because we turned it into a picture, but it is another option that you have. If you like carefully researched content like this, clearly presented in a step-by-step -step format so that you can get great results every time, then you'll love my other YouTube videos. So give this video a thumbs up and click to subscribe to the channel. And on the screen now, you'll see a video that I've handpicked for you to watch next.